Hello everyone, I'm Jodi Lynn and welcome to Aging Naturally where we talk about non-invasive better aging solutions for the mature skin. And in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you a new radio frequency device that I've been trying. I'm super excited to share with you, so let's get started. Meleg went ahead and reached out to me wanting me to try their radio frequency device. And the first thing that I was thinking to myself is, okay, first of all, is it safe? And it is, it's FDA cleared. Secondly, um, how is this different from what I've already been using? So the first way that it is different is not only can you use it on the skin to help tighten the skin, but you can also use it on the body, which I love. There's two different types of probes, one for the face, one for the body. As we know, when we age, our skin loses its elasticity. So our forearms, under the arm area, around our knees, the inner thighs, they be can become really wrinkly and kind of crepey. And this device is going to help smooth it out. Please note that this is not going to help you to lose weight. It's going to help tighten that top layer of that skin, giving it a more youthful look. For those of you that do not know radio frequency, it um, actually converts electrical energy into heat energy that goes deep into the dermis, about 131 to 149 degrees Fahrenheit. It is safe. It is painless. It stimulates collagen, improves elasticity, softens lines and reduces wrinkles, tightens and lifts the skin, accelerates blood circulation, and possibly even decrease cellulite, which we love. Just note that there is a 60-day money-back guarantee on this device, so you could always try it. If not interested, you can return it back. It also does have an 18-month warranty. It actually uses a bipolar um, type of radio frequency. So there's monopolar, unipolar, bipolar. Uh, just to give you some sort of comparison, um, NUA radio frequency, their 3D technology uses six different types of polarities. So just kind of keep that in mind. Um, I'm not going to go deep and heavy into each polarity and what they all mean, but um, there are definitely also medical offices that are using bipolar radio frequencies in their office. Just kind of keep that in mind as well. Um, but you have monopolar and you have bipolar and monopolar really gets deep into the skin. However, it's not tolerable. It's not an enjoyable experience and it's very painful for people. So um, bipolar is definitely a lot more tolerable. Bipolar applicators better control and distribute energy between electrodes and offer the improved ability to target more specific dermal structures for improved efficacy compared to monopolar and unipolar devices. So just kind of keep that in mind. Um, let's talk about results. So if you are 38 years of age or younger, you can see typical results probably in about four weeks. If you are 39 years of age or above or have more advanced signs of aging, you're looking at about two to five months to see results. And if you guys have been following me, you know that my when I started radio frequency, I'd say it was 90 days that I really saw huge improvements. So it's something you need to be consistent with and be patient and you will see results. Um, and also here are the treatment areas. So you can do the forehead, you can do the upper cheek, the lower cheek, you can also do the chin area, you can also do the neck area. Just make sure that you're never doing the middle of the neck. Definitely don't ever wanna do radio frequency or microcurrent on this area. Also, I would caution you, if you do have a very thin neck, radio frequency on the neck may not be for you. So um, I have tried radio frequency on my neck and just keeping it on this area right here. However, I did feel some discomfort in this area regardless of not even using it on this area. So um, I think that if you have a thinner neck, I would just be very cautious about that. I know that there are many people that have thicker necks that can use it on this area, but just keep that in mind. And I'd say a full treatment is gonna be anywhere from 20 to 25 minutes, again, depending on your treatment area. And of course, that's only um, twice a month. So let's go ahead, I'm gonna go ahead and get you into the demonstration. I found this very easy to use. Also just note that my face um, gets pretty red. I have sensitive skin. So this area, you'll see that my face tends to be really red from using this. Now, my mom has used this and her face does not get as red as mine. So just kind of keep that in mind. Um, just because my face in the video looks really red, I'm also using hydroquinone. I mean, there's some things that I'm using that um, my skin has become very sensitive. 
So um, that's normal for me. It was not painful. I also love that there are three settings. So you have level one, two, and three. So you can start off at a level one and then you can work your way up to that level three. So just kind of keep that in mind. Um, so my experience with redness may not be yours, but it was not painful. All right, so there are two different probes and you can see the difference in size. This one is going to be for your body and this one is going to be for your face. And this is you know, the one that I'm going to show you today. Very easy. All you do is just screw it on. There are three different levels. So I suggest starting off with level one um, and then work your way up to level three. If you just go right in with level three, it's really hot. I mean, I'm a radio frequency user. I've been using it for since April, uh, the newer device, and I found level three to be like just a little too much. So I start at level two and then you can definitely work your way up, but just kind of keep that in mind. Okay, so the device you need to power on, there is a switch on the back and you will hear it. There is some noise. I wouldn't say it's super loud. Maybe you can hear it on, um, um, on the video, but it lets you know that it's on. The device will not start heating until you click on the time. So when you click on time, there are three options, 10 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minutes. And you do need to watch the time because each treatment area um, has different times. And once the time runs out and it gets to zero, the uh, device will no longer heat and it will stop. Okay, I'm gonna be using their gel. <clears throat> I say use a lot of gel. I like to just put some gel on the probe, but make sure that you use a good amount. And then I'm going to place that. We're gonna do the forehead first. And the forehead is going to be five minutes. Okay, it's starting to heat up and I'm just going up and down in, in this area and I'm gonna do this for five minutes. I'm not going to keep you with me <laughs> the entire time because this video will be so long, but I think that you get the idea. This is kind of what you're doing and you will notice some redness um, on your skin. This is totally normal. It means it's working. It's not gonna last forever. It, it, depending on you know your skin is gonna be how long your redness stays. Mine stays anywhere from 30 to 30 minutes to 45 minutes. Five minutes, I like to do an LED light therapy after uh, this treatment. I find that that does definitely help. I'm going to level three because I feel like I really can. The larger the motions, um, the heat won't be as intense, but smaller motions the heat will be more intense. Just kind of keep that in mind. This is my second time using it and I feel like I'm already kind of getting used to the heat because level three was pretty hot for me. Um, and this seems to be doing okay this time around. I like to actually watch YouTube videos, catch up on my YouTube videos while I'm doing my radio frequency. Just make sure that you're always moving the device. Never leave it in one area as it will burn the skin. So it needs to constantly be in motion. So now we're gonna go on to the eye area. Um, I would not use it in here, but just use it on that orbital bone and into the crow's feet area and you're gonna go side to side. It would start out a level one because this area is just a little bit more sensitive. I'm just gonna go. Side to side. I'm just gonna stick on this one side for right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this area. Um, and this is gonna be the cheek area. Get a lot on there. And this is going to be five minutes. chin and this is actually three minutes okay. 
Okay, we are done. As you can see, the face is a bit red. This is normal. I'll show you what I like to do in just a moment. I'm gonna go ahead and do the rest of my face and I'll be right back. What I like to do to just kind of calm my face down is I love these globes and I keep these in the refrigerator. Don't put them in the freezer. <laughs> your face will stick to you. will stick to your face. So I just like to keep them in the refrigerator and they're just really nice and cool. And I just like to go back and forth and it feels just so wonderful. Also, if it's really hot, it's wonderful. And also if you're having hot flashes, <laughs> putting these on your neck during a hot flash is just like, Okay, so now what I'm gonna do is use my Isn't Tree toner because it has anti-inflammatory properties and I'm going to use red light therapy for about 20 minutes. I think that this is great because red light therapy also helps with the healing process. So it can be just really great to do after um, radio frequency. But for that price, not only can you use it for the face, but you can use it on the body. I think that's a huge pro. So I love that there's three settings. You can do one, two, and three and work your way up. Also, you can use any radio frequency gel. It does come with a gel, but once you run out, you don't need to purchase their gel, but any type of radio frequency gel is gonna work. I just would not use a microcurrent gel because they're different modalities. So make sure that you use a radio frequency gel. I honestly didn't think that there was a lot of cons in this device, except for the fact that the device is pretty large. So it's going to take up some space and it's not going to be as uh, easy to travel with. Also, another thing that I wanted to point out as potentially a con is that the probes, they're pretty heavy duty and pretty solid. So they're going to be a little bit more heavy on the hand. So when you're kind of doing this for like five minutes in one area, your arm might get tired pretty quickly. I asked my mom, cause she used the device and I was like, well, what do you think mom? Is it kind of irritating to you? And she says, no, I'm just, you know, I just move it over to my other hand. Not a big deal. She actually enjoyed using it. She says it was a pleasant experience. She liked actually the warming sensation. She started out at a level one, then went to a two. And she said that she really liked how warm it was. She said it felt really calming and relaxing. So she really enjoyed the whole experience in using this device. Which leads me to my mom is actually gonna be using this device. So I'm going to give you some before and afters. Um, we're getting her on a whole skincare routine, which I'm super excited about. And um, I'll be showing you some before and afters, you know, in three months, four months, five months to see how this device performs. Let me go ahead and share with you my before and afters on this device. I only have used it twice um, in the month of October. And my expectation was not to have anything go backwards. If I didn't look at my first picture, this is the end of my six month update with using the new one. This was the end of September. This is what I showed you in my uh, six month update. I didn't show you the second picture. This was taken at the end of October after using the device twice. And I have to say, I'm very happy. I am not seeing anything going backwards. Everything is looking good and I am happy with this. So it's gonna be interesting to see, you know, the changes in my mom's skin using this device. That's all that I have for you. If you have any questions, please go ahead and let me know in the comment section below. And yeah, if you like this video, please go ahead and give it a like. Make sure that you subscribe, hit the notification bell to all so that you do not miss my upcoming videos. Until next time.